So, in case you were wondering, does this random YouTuber have friends? Nobody was wondering that. But, to answer the question nobody asked, I do. And I'm just going to advertise them a little bit. They're both VTubers. And I thought, it would be cool if I learned how to make those too. Because it's a great idea. I don't have to show my face, but I can still show expressions. I tried to make the cube to like make more expressions, but the cube is so simple that the amount of expressions it can make are also very simple. I thought VTuber sounds like a better idea, so I started doing it. And um, watched a lot of YouTube videos, started the free trial, and just got started to see how it would go and I am not surprised by any means that you know my first one came out bad so let me show you my first one here didn't know how to turn the head in all honesty um it just looks bad a little bit better I separated things better but still looks a bit awkward and you know just moves around intimidating but still pretty intimidating see there's more head movement the head movement is weird but it moves you can also move the eyebrow Yep, eyebrow moves, you can blink, you can look side to side. Obviously you can't wink because there's only one eye and you know. But for some reason, redhead was better than the one I made next. I tried my hand at making a fairy fox. So this one, I tried my hand at physics a bit more. Like you can see it wiggle a little. Yep, you can see the hair wiggling. The eyes look really, really scary. Yeah, like right there. It looks really creepy. I used to watch that as a kid and the newest episode came out while I was like researching how to make VTubers and I'm like, oh, I could combine these two. I can't. I really cannot. It came out bad. I tried to change it up because I made a lot of things wrong. So I tried to change it up for the second time and they still came out wrong. Uh, a few characters from Full Moon. I got started on my wings. However, there is a glitch. <sighs> Yeah, you can see the mouth, like, go into the bow. So, the wings are cute, though. It doesn't have mouth tracking, but you can frown and smile. And I was doing all of this in preparation for my actual VTuber. So, all of those previous ones were practice models. Those weren't going to be, like, my main model was drafting the design for my actual VTuber. And this is my very first design. <laughs> oh God, it looks so much worse. As you see me progress, it looks so much worse. Oh, it's so bad. Uh, I had a friend help me out, giving me advice on how to make it better. I realized I just needed to scrap the entire concept I was going for. Cause I was trying to turn the cube into a human. So like make a human version of the cube. Except like I said before, that cube is annoyingly simple that it is an atrociously difficult. It's so simple, it's nearly impossible to make an accurate face of it. Like the green the main color, I'll just make one that suits me with green as, you know, like a secondary color. Because I wanted to do one based off of how I looked. So I chose a skin tone from when I was a bit darker, and I decided to use that as the skin tone for my model. And I had to figure out what color do I put in between my skin tone and the green so that my skin tone doesn't look so weird. Because at first it looked really weird alongside the green. So I settled on a shade of purple because purple is my favorite color. And I settled on a lighter shade which really balances it out perfectly. Like I designed an outfit. I uploaded it on my Kofi, Like a sneak peek, I guess. And then I made the model. The model's like ironically enough doesn't show a lot of the clothes because it's only like belly button up and it was also around this time that i realized the problem was not the models per se because every single time i would test it out the mouth would not track properly and i'm like why isn't it why is it not tracking like i've put in every single dot i have put in like so many dots to show where the mouth should be when i'm moving the mouth why is it not tracking and then I realized it was my camera. My laptop is spectacular. I love my laptop. It is great in every way. It has a lot of space. It does a really great job of using several programs at once. It's great at editing. Like, I love my laptop. It's a good laptop. But in order for it to be that good, it had to give up something. And that something was the webcam. 
Well, part of the problem is my models. Like, I'm not going to deny yeah. that. But another part of it is simply that I don't have a good enough webcam for the model to be able to track my face, especially the mouth, which is honestly more important to me than every other thing it does because it helps with the expressions. What I'm saying is I need to get a webcam in order for my model to work properly. That's not a huge priority right now. My main priority is like learning how to make a model. After I make the model, I'll start looking into webcams and getting one for myself. Uh, right now, I have a lot of other financial burdens to deal with, so that's not going to be possible. Donate to my coffee. Little advertising there. This whole time, I've been talking about making models and making my own models, and I'm sure you're dying to see what it actually came out to look like, you know, like, what's your actual model? Come on, stop avoiding it. So I will show it in a second, but first, I have a quick advertisement here. All right, and a little bit of news here at the end. I have updated my Kofi shop so that you can buy some of the models for your own use. I only ask that you include the link to the Kofi page, so at least... You know, I get something out of it. Whatever you want, it's gonna be really cheap. I think I put it at like one or two dollars. To totally check out my Kofi page, I'm gonna be putting updates on the YouTube channel. I'm going to be uploading some pictures that I've made, some drawings. Uh, they're not that great yet, but I'm working on it. I'm learning, studying hard. You can donate if you want, but really it's just gonna be me. Like, other people have Reddits or Discords to like chat. For me, it's gonna be Kofi. Now that you've checked out the link to my Kofi, and bought yourself a model. I will show you the model, just letting you know I'm not gonna show every single feature it has because I will be releasing a separate video showing all the features it has and also including it in the Kofi shop. So without further ado, here it is. So this is the final version. Uh, as you can see, my face tracking is not good. Um, ooh, e Oh, ooh. yeah, you can tell it's not that great because there's a lot more facial expressions, but they don't show up. And this is on the highest setting, so it's really just the fact that I'm using a webcam. As you can see, great shoes. They step. Yep, great shoes. Uh, pants could use a little work. Uh, because of how the pants are designed, it looks like the knees are down here. And we got the nice toned, muscular hands. Got a little belly button piercing. Hello. Yeah, uh, there's a bit of hair that just likes to stick out. I tried to fix it. One eye is uneven. You can really see that there. Um, you have shocked. So dead eyes is when the color is lost in your eyes to like give a I'm about to kill everybody. I'm going to show you crying. There's angry. And then we have one of my favorite ones, which is D's nuts. Get it? These nuts. <laughs> My favorite one is Mr. Chu. Dana, Mr. Chu. Dana, Mr. Chu. Yeah. Uh, when it comes to these nuts, uh, you can also do it crying. Like, I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> but that is my model.